out. This is the hole I dug several months back. This is where I dug out the, um, the calcium carbonate I was just using in the other experiment. You can see uh, I, I never hit the bottom or the end of where this calcium carbonate ends and I just got tired of digging and I, I had as much as I needed. There you can see, I don't know if you can see the different colors, you can see that there's other um, minerals and elements stri st striped through this. You can see some pink colors and, and different things. And I even got, um, there was uh, deposits, little round rocks that were in there. I didn't know what they were at first, but uh, later I found uh, a description that uh, they were maybe called geodes. So I'm not sure where I've, or, well, I put them in a bag, I've got them somewhere, and later on I'm going to get a diamond-tipped blade to cut them open. Um, I've heard some people um, found bismuth and amethyst and various other uh, crystals. Some were just full of um, almost crystal clear um, calcium carbonate crystals and various other elements crystallized elements inside so it should be interesting to see what I find inside those round rocks maybe they're just solid round but you could see that these rocks were a crystal the outside of the rock was a crystal that was a completely different type of stone from this really soft calcium carbonate that this rock is made up of now that red color I was asking around and um, various people said it's a it's a clay and about 100, 100 kilometers from here, I think, there's a town called Tikul, and they have um, large deposits of choline clay, and it's, um, I guess, sandwiched against a big granite rock. So there's, there has been some uh, geological activity here, um, even though this is a very stable like a geologically stable area. There's no earthquakes or anything. Um, as far as I know, no fault lines or anything. But um, that uh, tells me there's there's aluminum as well as iron and various other minerals here. So it should be interesting to find out what kind of minerals I do find in this area. Now just to, to show what I've used the majority of this, this calcium carbonate. I use it as a floor for my little chicken pen, or big chicken pen. Using a typical style here, I am living in the Yucatan, so had some local workers help me put the roof on here.